welcome back to my channel. How are you all doing? I hope you're good. If you're new around here, I'm Tiffany, Press of Power. It's really lovely to meet you. If you're not new, welcome back, my friends. It's great to have you here. Welcome back to another episode of Throwback Tuesday, but also this week is for Cadet, you guys. It's been two years since he passed away, so we're gonna bring back some old bangers of his and just appreciate him. Do you know what I mean? So let's get into it, but before I do, like the video, drop me some comments, most of all subscribe. I appreciate every single one of you, honestly. Thank you very much. Like I said in the last video, like this is a recap, yeah? Like, Cadets in like my top three artists, so I know these songs kind of like the back of my hand, but I can't not put this out because these tunes are mad. So let's get into it and see. This might be one of my favorite songs of all time. <laughs> Sorry, I know it's annoying that I keep pausing, but this was released as a freestyle and then as a tune as well on Spotify, innit? Um, like, they're ever so slightly different, but they're basically the same. And I'm so happy that happened because I literally bang out this freestyle on Spotify ha, pretty much every day. <laughs> <laughs> Look. Again, he's performing it to all his people then. He's performing it to them. He's not just making a tune and putting it out there. Like, these tunes he's making for his people, in it, So they know how he feels. He's performing it to them. It's mad. This guy is so sad that he's not here anymore. So sad. Like, I could do with new music from Cadet, man. Ah! Bless him. Look, I grew up on south of the Thames So yeah man, I know about a stereotype A screw face and a gold tooth Nah mummy, I ain't gonna be those guys I'm gonna be a lawyer when I'm older Bullshit, I'm gonna live a life so nice But now, look at all this gold in my mouth It's fucked how I be the stereotype I never finished college, never went uni I've sold drugs and my credit's so bad I cheat too, I kinda like beef And I've probably been in about six gangs I like lighties, I like jewelry And most of my man them have been jail me I've got girls pregnant that I never loved So I could have been a baby father as well I've got Gucci belts, I'm Muslim And I rap like every other black boy up in the country I ain't gonna rob nobody, believe me Earth, Earth, the flow as well I hope you're deep in what he's saying, but the flow is naughty, naughty, like, you don't even need to break down stuff by cadet, like, that's what I'm saying to you, he's so easy, like, he's, he, he finds it so easy to sling together a story, yeah, and it just makes you visualise everything perfectly, and as an artist, that's what you want your consumers to be feeling and doing, do you know what I mean, like, oh, I willed it as well. <laughs> Look, I grew up on south of the Thames So yeah man, I know about a stereotype A screw face and a gold tooth Nah mummy, I ain't gonna be those guys I'm gonna be a lawyer when I'm older Bullshit, I'm gonna live a life so nice But now, look at all this gold in my mouth It's fucked how I be the stereotype I never finished college, never went uni I've sold drugs and my credit's so bad I cheat too, I kinda like beef And I've probably been in about six gangs I like lighties, I like jewelry And most of my man them have been jail me I've got girls pregnant that I never loved So I could have been a baby father as well I've got Gucci belts, I'm Muslim And I rap like every other black boy up in the country I ain't gonna rob nobody, believe me, real shit I just think now hoodies are comfy I wanna sleep tight, I drink Henny And most of the pussy I get don't bring joy in a free Cross, start drinking piss. I'll be in a club like we piss boys. I got no reason for not checking my nan. And when she dies, I'm gonna kick myself because what she really wants is a phone call. But I don't do it. I admit that I'm a prick myself. You see, I'm fucked around with girls' emotions. I'm do you know how deep that is? Do you know how deep that is? Uh, he says, All my nan really wants is a phone, phone call, yeah? But I don't do that. I admit it. I'm a prick myself. Mad. He said, when I know when she dies, I'm gonna regret it as well. I'm gonna kick myself. My nan. And when she dies, I'm gonna kick myself because what she really wants is a phone call. But I don't do it, I admit that I'm a prick myself. You see, I'm fucked around with girls' emotions. I'm a business slut, that I admit it to. Been a slut, I admit it to. Listen, the way he links everything in as well. And a bag of times when I play on cards, I ain't been too sure if it's going through. And my hairline's fucked and I can't make friends, yeah. That sums me up in some words. And besides that, you got my mum. God knows she don't get the love she deserves and no I ain't been the best son I no excuse that I give is a good enough reason for me just to feel like she's a part of my life or just to see if I've eaten and yeah it was fucked how I treat my mum and them choices that I made are dumb but still she'll stand up in front of a crowd of people and be like he's my son mum he carried me for nine months uh, that's nine months it took nine months for me to pop out but I can't find ten minutes and pop in it's fucked uh, 
How did I get disrespectful? How can I drive past the house 10 times in a day? I'm not once going and check you. No, Again, like, I'm, I'm watching these visuals, yeah? And I'm watching how people are reacting to how he's hearing. It's like a reaction and a reaction, isn't it? But, it, that, like, that's what plays on my heartstrings, isn't it? Because these are his closest people and, oh, my. No ask once if your days me stressful. We need a son there when they came to rescue this fuck. I haven't got the time to text you, but I've got the time for the girls online and sexual. When I'm no, them bills are piling up. And you won't admit it, but I'm letting you down. And I remember when I got my car, I said you won't ever have to put your foot on the ground. I know you got the lines in your fingers, because you wouldn't bought bare shit that's weighing the bag down. I should at least call a car a cab round at her. How he mean, like, you know how deep it is as well, because he's sitting there, yeah, and as he's as he's saying these bars, yeah, he's feeling his fingers, like he's talking about her carrying bare carrier bags and you know when it leaves like marks in your fingers, like as he's fucking delivering this to Usher, he's literally sitting there like touching his fingers, like he's imagining this is so real for him, like you can just tell it's so raw, like it's just so raw. It's like, oh, I can't even explain it, yeah, but there's just, the bars are like, he's not scared of his truth in it. A lot of people are scared of their truth because they don't like what people think of that or they don't like what category they're going to put people in, innit? But he's just so raw, like, it's, I think that's what makes him different class. No, I can hear the bus in the background. I'm slacking as a son, and I'm noticed. I ain't doing half of the shit I'm supposed to. I got a little brother that I never checked. I'm meant to go through all of the shit that you go through. You're meant to be my queen. I'm out here treating you like a jester. Bring you gifts not only in December, but honestly, birthdays I can barely remember. When it comes to money, I'm fucked. Yeah, trust me, I know. See, I hear asking her for money, but when I do, I right, cool. Look, here's how it normally goes. Your mummy, I need some money. She'll say cool and go cash point on the road and take out money that she don't really have, but she loves me way too much. She's saying no. You see, I'm almost tired when I wrote this because I picture my mum walking through the door with a fake smile giving me the cash to say she loves me way too much she's saying no now I know my need ain't greater but now I can't say no of another because she says being able to provide for her son is what makes her feel like a mother and she won't take the money are you deep in that cycle are you deep oh like money is for me like I feel like money's the root of all evil anyways but that is a deeper cycle that many of us go through but none of us have the fucking balls to say it. Cash true say she loves me way too much to say no. Now I know my need ain't greater. But now I can't say no of another. Cause she says being able to provide for her son is what makes her feel like a mother and she won't take the money back. So how the fuck am I meant to feel? Cause now I got money for bullshit. But that might mean she has to go skip a meal with him. When it comes to my little brother, didn't I'm slipping? See me and never make time with him. But the truth is that boy means everything to me. See that boy is my rhythm, the simple. Matt, did you hear that, yeah? He said um, about his younger brother, he said, that boy means everything to me. He gives me my rhythm and it's when his flow changes up. Bullshit. But I might mean she has to go skip a meal when, when it comes to my little brother didn't I'm slipping. See me and never make time with him. But the truth is that boy means everything to me. See that boy is my rhythm, the simple shit. Yeah, my mum would say, go hey, tell him. As simple as that sounds, that gives so much depth to this. So much. Cause he ain't done all the dishes But I'm thinking like If I ain't been around Then why the fuck would he listen Shit Look I've become that Stereotypical That big bro That will buy you all the trains But won't sit and cool So niggerish For blacks that typical issue You know I'll buy you football boots But Never find time to kick the ball with you, huh? So now I gotta switch up. I gotta care a little less about getting my dicks up. Make sure the next time mum phones ring, she ain't gotta think twice about death before she picks up music. Look, you have to work. And if you don't, then I don't know because I'm man enough to tell you now that I don't really wanna go back to the road, you see. Deep. Deep. Like, legit, when he says that like, I'm man enough to tell you now, yeah, like, he ain't wrong, innit? He is not wrong. Like, oh, I can't tell you guys how much, like, how fucking clever, like, this is. Drink, she ain't got to think twice about death before she picks up music. Look, you have to work. And if you don't, then I don't know because I'm man enough to tell you now that I don't really want to go back to the road, you see. Them niggas rap for a new chain. Don't get it twisted, I wear one, but that shit will come after all them bills are paid And I can say, yo, go get your hair done Everyone talks about stereotypes, but no one admits to the stereotypes So fuck it, I put my hands on, look, I'm some real shit, I be the stereotype Some real shit, that's what I'm saying, nobody will admit to this shit My man's just sitting there like, yeah, cool, like, I admit to all of it and I'll tell you more as well
Yo type had a wife that was good for me, that I never should have let go I'd be the stereotype, that nigga with a nice car But driving it to his mum's house I'd be the stereotype, I got an ex named Tanisha and Felicia Bullshit, I'd be the stereotype, so my credit so shit I can only get cash cards nigga I'd be the stereotype that pay taxes but too embarrassed to sign on yeah I'd be the stereotype that spend my last peas on clothes Look good but broke yeah I'd be the stereotype, probably in a girl's friend zone right now Just waiting to fuck that stereotype I tell my young G stay out of trouble But then catch a case that stereotype and I pray How deep this is? If you listen to it, like, because he's talking about, like, contradicting, like, things that contradict each other as well, and it? Talking about one thing and then being the complete opposite. Pay taxes, but too embarrassed to sign on, yeah. I'd be the stereotype that spend my last peas on clothes. Look, good but broke, yeah. I'd be the stereotype, probably in a girl's friend zone right now. Just waiting to fuck that stereotype. I tell my young G, stay out of trouble. But then catch a case that stereotype, and I pray my daughter's never a hoe. But yeah, love Jay Z's the stereotype, and I feel embarrassed when I'm. That's deeper as well. Man said, I pray my daughter is never a hoe. But I love these Jay Z. Listen. The world will only change in one way. Never a hoe, but yeah, love Jay Z's the stereotype, and I feel embarrassed when I'm around Muslims that I want deem that stereotype. And the worst one is, never see a man get stabbed on the ends on that war and shit. And the feds ask me to help out and bring justice. Me, I say I never saw that shit, but if my house got burgled or a white man shot my nan in public, and the feds never helped me out, I'd be the first one screaming, Where's the justice? I am that typical nigga, yeah, I am trying to put a good stereotype, yeah, I am that nigga with a bop in his step, yeah, I am. K -k 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 I know who I am, that stereotype. Stereotype. Yeah, that's it. There was more people there from the last freestyle in it, but it's the same kind of setup, like, and you could recognize some of the same people from the last one. So it's definitely like his people, them. I just, I think it's so mad. And I generally can't tell you how much, like, I miss his music and I miss, like, what his brain is capable of making because there's not a lot of other artists that excite me and can entertain me as much as Cadet could and still does. Don't get it twisted. Don't get it, like, on a daily basis as well, which is mad. But as always, guys, if you got to the end of the video, please leave me a thumbs up. Drop me some comments if you want to see any other cadet tunes. If you want me to react to them, drop it in the comments below and I'll check them out this week. I'm probably just going to drop cadet after cadet. So keep an eye out, guys, and I will see you very soon for another one. Stay safe. I am out. <laughs>